let's have a look at your charts, Mr. Peppard. Hmm, yes, looking better than yesterday. Oh, thank you, Doctor. Now, you might feel a small prick. Wouldn't be the first. Brace yourself. I'm going to give you one in the posterior. I should be so lucky. Is this your first time? I hope you know where you're sticking that thing. Don't worry. It isn't hard. Mm, speak for yourself. Shall I get my cock out? <laughs> what? Dr. Asquith, go and help Nurse Sidebottom. No! Can I get you tea or coffee, darling? As a lovely pair of jugs. Oh, Jakey, just get your hands off and they're hot. Tell me something I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to rub them on my cock? <laughs> Asquith! Come with me. What on earth is wrong with you, Dr. Asquith? This is supposed to be a bawdy 1970s hospital. Please stick to using innuendo. I'm sorry, sir, but to be honest, I've never really understood the difference between double entendres and the stuff I say. Let me try to explain. If I say, would you like to grasp my rod, that's innuendo. Would you like to wank off my cock, that's not. Do you see what I mean? Not really. <laughs> Maybe you're not cut out to be a doctor in a bawdy 1970s hospital. All right. Perhaps it's for the best if I leave. I think you're right. Now, there's no need to make a scene. Just leave discreetly. I think it's best if you use the rear entrance and go up the back passage. Who, <laughs> uh, Mrs? Too late. <laughs>